War always carries a cost. And my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, sometimes I have to lose. In order to save Selena from this fate, I had to give myself up. My life for hers. Now, there's nothing to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from killing everyone at the Sanctus facility and stealing a virus that could wipe out Gotham. Meanwhile, I face the cold embrace I'm here, I'm here. Harley had me thrown into one of Freeze's cryo chambers. But I'm okay now. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm afraid I was starting to panic. I've got it under control, Alfred. Is the pact still in the subway? No. I'm bringing the car around. Call Waller. Tell her the pact means to slaughter their way into Sanctus, and I'm going after it. What? Have you shot on sight, Bruce? I'm not going as Bruce. It's time to let Batman handle things. sign of Harley or the others. spa workers. More death and destruction. This blood trail looks like they dragged something. Looking for Project Lotus. Looks like the alarm system has been disabled. Who? Who's there? I swear to God! 
<laughs> Where did they go? They went down in the elevator. Do you have access? It's got to scan my eyes. <sighs> Another use for Riddler's eyes. Call it for me! No way! Those freaks are down there! They'll kill me if they see me. What are you doing? Open your eyes or I'll do it for you. You son of a bitch! Send paramedics. I've already made the call. I contacted Director Waller. She, um, wants to speak with you. Now. Put her through. Batman, where are you? Give me a status update. I'm at the Sanctus facility. I split with the Pact, and they beat me here. It's a bloodbath. I ordered you not to blow your cover. What the hell were you thinking? You could have been there to prevent this. I was thinking about stopping the pact, which is way more than you're doing right now. Don't make this a fight with me. Just look at the bodies and ask yourself if it was worth it. We'll be there to back you up soon. We're gonna put an end to this once and for all. Looks like Sanctus security barely slowed them down. That's why you have to keep them there until we arrive. That virus cannot be allowed to leave the facility. Don't mess this up again. The store lock requires a key card. Handiwork. Someone's trapped under there. Just injure yourself more. It's too late for that. Stop them. Here. Take my... What are you doing? I don't know if you stole Harley's laptop or not, but I'm glad you kept them from icing me. I'm returning the favor. 
I'm on guard duty along with three gunmen who are all watching that door up ahead. If I hadn't stopped you, you'd be full of holes right now. We don't always see eye to eye, but I'd much prefer you in one piece. I'm just glad to see you alive. Same. After seeing them throw you in Frieza's meat locker, I wasn't sure if that was the end. I've seen a lot of death recently. Harley encouraged Freeze and Bane. They killed anyone they wanted. I should have done something more to stop them. But I didn't. Bane! What did I say about touching the equipment? <laughs> Be quiet, you imbecile! I'm going to make this right. I'll help you stop them. Whatever I have to do, they're not getting that virus. Whatever it is, I can do it. Good. We'll fight them together. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Anything in here could kill ya. So keep your hand to yourself. Let's do this. It's an automated extraction process. You can't rush it. <sighs> I've seen Freezy's popsicle wipe move faster than this thing. on us, kitty. I weighed my options and, what can I say, I don't like to lose. You made a big mistake. Iris is almost extracted. All right, Bets. What made you think you'd be able to stop all of us? I wouldn't put money on your chances of walking out of here. Maybe we should try a therapy circle. I know all your tricks, Harley. Please. I know your type. You think you know me. Just so, so wrong. Unfortunately, we have a tight schedule. But I always have time to kill you. Get him, boys!
That's for messing with my Batman. Go fight your own hero. <laughs> Save them for you. Please evacuate the lab through the emergency elevator. Batman, we're in the facility now. Harley! Wait up! No! I'm infected! What are you doing? You need me! Not anymore. Harley! Harley's getting away. Come on, we'll find you. Get down! Get down! down. We didn't stop Harley. You did enough. Now get out of here. See you around sometime. Alfred, call Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley escaped with a virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bioscans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Batman. Good work? Harley escaped with the Lotus virus. Your girlfriend, Catwoman, is nowhere to be found. Same goes for your boy, John. So if good work means half the pact is loose in Gotham, and we've got a megavirus in the hands of a psychopath, then yes, this is picture perfect. How oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. Catwoman and John are not a concern. Our focus needs to be on Quinn. As much as I hate to admit it, you have a point. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. 
chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. It's about time this technology was used for good. I couldn't agree with you more, Batman. I'm gonna need your help tracking down Quinn. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> Don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. That was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. It's been a rough night for everyone. I don't know. Something seems off. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will. Give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. deserve this. You need help, Freeze. <laughs> you think? I'm here to talk about Harley Quinn. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. If the agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me, they mean to study me. Given the chance, I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're saying Riddler became infected with the Lotus virus when he worked for Sanctus. If he could survive it, I believe I can too. <clears throat> That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. I will do that for you. But first, tell me what you know. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is, the Lotus virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. And now she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. 
She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised. the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? She can't keep secrets from me. I always get to the truth. <laughs> I have no doubt. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. We could use Bruce on this one. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. What does that mean? If Harley sees Batman coming, she may do something drastic. But if she sees Bruce, she'll think she can take you. You don't know I'm the one that told Waller who you really are. Hmm. Are we... Are we all good? I'd like to clear the air. Sure. We're good. Oh. <sighs> all right then. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. You say she can't keep secrets from you. I never thought she'd have reason to keep them from me. Ah! Damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? Oh, damn it, sorry. I... I... I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I was saying the car as a passive security system. It triggered feedback in, in your hearing aids. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great, but, you know, it's no Batmobile. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila, Batmobile. That's incredible, if you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah, Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. I've done what I had to do. I don't always enjoy it, but it's part of being... Batman. If I don't question it, I'm as bad as the criminals I fight. That makes sense. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? Yeah. It's 
Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. So what are you saying? I wish I knew exactly. I was hoping talking to you might give me some clarity. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. If she has Riddler's blood, she'll be incredibly dangerous. You don't need to tell me. She tried to freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. A4, plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Damn it. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. C4 and stolen blood. How do those two things add up? So... Keep looking. Someone's damaged this. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. It could have been used to access Freeze's container with the vials.
Oh, God. I thought this thing was supposed to preserve him. Obviously, it failed. Wait. Decomposition is actually accelerated. They purposefully disabled the capsule. If that's the case, then they were trying to destroy the body. It's textbook asset denial. But it's some sloppy work. They were moving fast. Too fast. If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh my. This may take a bit of time. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. Bruce. The Pact all had medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus. Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> She's a friend, John. Our friend. I had a friend. It didn't work out. Oh, hey! Hold on. Are you two-timing cat lady, Bruce? <clears throat> She was here? Yeah. Ugh. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just be yourself, John. <laughs> Did I stuck my neck out for you? Way out! Bane nearly ripped my head off. And for what? She flew the coop! I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn. Every bad piece of advice. Everything blew up in my face. This isn't my fault. Harley betrayed us. Both of us. Yeah. But you weren't in love with her. There's no point. It's over. The pact. Dream? Us? Not yet, it's not. She's still out there, with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, 
I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you. No matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, Sean. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. Certainly not for Gotham. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Okay, buddy. Look, the agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here in a very dark place. They didn't find me, but Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. She gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever want to see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. You won't have to see her. We won't involve you, I promise. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. You gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no, you won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is... I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. We really like your help, John. Are you sure you won't reconsider us coming with you? It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. There? I'm back. I'm taking over at the computer. Please don't. Al. Al, can you hear me? Alfred? Oh, uh, uh, it, what's, what's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's, let's chat. Now's the time. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes, what would Master Bruce think about what you've done? I don't know. He, he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Well, 
Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Ah, oh, no, it was... it was nothing. I was... Felt, I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. Uh, and, well, basically, that's all there is to it. Hey, 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 slow down, slow down, relax. I'm gonna take care of you. Uh, I couldn't be in better hands. Don't worry. I'll be back up in no time. Uh, oh, Chet. Hey, 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 hey. Be careful. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. The bioscan of Riddler's body, I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. It's only because they think they found Eden. A way to cure all of their problems. Men rarely share their prosperity, even if it brings them ruin. The fools. Run the simulation again, then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Uh, I already ran it several times myself. Uh, I... I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is... A very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Then let's get you to a nice beach, huh? Or wherever you want to go. Ooh, the possibilities. That'll take some thinking. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. Just... hold on. Let me find a way to help. You've got to be around in case John finds Harley. And this needs to be done quickly. I won't let Waller turn the Agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. The vials have to go. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. 
She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. I'm sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I'll let Alfred tell you himself. I told you, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So... Bruce... Um... After our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I know you said I needed to train, but... I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. para aramid synthetic lining. Photo-adaptive suit coloring. Full-spectrum, full-surround heads-up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. That man doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. I don't use a gun, because Batman doesn't kill. Okay, I get it. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds? Of course I think about it sometimes. It'd be the easiest thing in the world. But easy doesn't make it right. Bingo. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here.
John? Dr. Quinzel, this is Harley's. It's easy on me, you know? What am I gonna say to Bruce? It, it, it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self-defense. I, I know it needs work! Stop! Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just... It, it's, it's not what it looks like. Explain. Just try and reserve judgment. Take a deep breath, John. Just calm down. It was horrible. Just horrible. But you're, you're right. I, I should do my exercises. Get, get a hold of myself. What happened? Is Harley here? She left. Just as I got here, the agents, they came looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up. I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they wouldn't listen. They, they just wanted blood. Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm, so, I'm sorry. I, I always laugh when I'm nervous. Ha, 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 ha.
colors. I wonder what Harley would think of the new color scheme. <laughs> you said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Oh, really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I... I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in. This just happened, right? I'm surprised you don't have more clarity. You're saying I'm lying? I'm saying it's strange. If I hadn't fought them off, I'd be the one lying in a pool of blood. You, you, you believe me, don't you? Because if we don't have trust, what do we really have? What kind of question is that? Of course I do. Then, then what's with all the suspicion? You're just trying to tell me what you think I want to hear. You're supposed to be on my side! I guess I'm an idiot for expecting that, aren't I? What do you mean? Whatever this is between us, it's off balance. The goodwill only flows one way, and it isn't towards me. You've made that very clear by now. Yeah, it is off balance, but not the way you're saying. You are the ones surrounded by corpses. Corp! It's all my fault. Why should Bruce Wayne have to take responsibility for anything? I should have known things were wrong when you drank Harley's slushy after I told you I was in love. You've been using me from the start! At least have the decency to admit it! The least you can do is come clean about that! Okay. Maybe I have been using you. I'm sorry, John, but there's more at stake here than your feelings. It's like Dr. Leland always said. Never demean another person's emotions! John? <laughs> I know. You can fight better than that. What do you need your bat suit to really get you in the mood? What? You forget I know you, Bruce. The real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, businessman, criminal. Bat. Can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. John, John, that's ridiculous. I'm the furthest thing from Batman there is. No, you don't have to keep your mask on anymore, Bruce. Not with me. <sighs> oh, are you gonna make me trot out all the evidence? All right. How about the vanishing act you pulled at the cafe when the bat signal showed up? You don't think I noticed how obvious that was? You think you can use that against me? As blackmail? Oh, I would never! We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Bound together, even under strain. Then what's your point? After we raided the agency's convoy, Harley stashed one of their trucks here. And now it's gone. Which means she's getting out of town. Across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. I'm not asking for much. Just a little faith. I swear to you, this was self-defense. One more time. You do believe me, don't you? still have faith in me, don't you? Your old buddy, John? 
This is a mess. And we are gonna need to talk about it more. But... I believe you. I'm sorry I doubted you, John. Gosh, Bruce, I'm... I'm overcome. I'm sorry I doubted you. But I, I feel so much better now that we've hashed this out. We've got to catch up with Harley before these murderous agents find her. She's got explosives and the virus. If they start shooting, things could get really exciting. Oh, boy! <laughs> if I had known these were your wheels, I never would have stolen that beater. Even if I wanted to. I mean it! The bridge and every sad son of a bitch on it! The blood is gone! The serum you want is no longer an option! Stand down now! No one needs to get hurt! I said get back! They're gonna kill her, Bruce! They're gonna shoot first and ask questions later! I can't just stand here and do nothing! We can't let that happen! John, don't do anything stupid. Stupid? Me? When have I ever? I'm going to try not to be offended, Bruce. You know how I feel about personal insults. John, John, you're right. You're right. I take it back. Thank you. Although I kind of get where you're coming from. Wayne, about time you showed up. What in the good goddamn is he doing here? Director Waller, John Doe's, uh, been aiding Bruce's investigations. This creature's with you? Amanda Waller, meet John Doe. He's a trusted friend. I'm, uh, I'm here to defuse the situation. I have my doubts. But hell, at this point, I'll try anything. Harley's making demands we simply can't meet. Her detonator's on a dead man's switch. She lets it go. This bridge is history. This situation is rapidly spiraling out of control. I'm running out of options. Harley is heading towards a cliff, and she's gonna drag all of us with her. I can talk her off the ledge. Just give me a moment. She won't listen. All she wants is Riddler's goddamn blood. And that's gone. One of my own people destroyed it. Someone inside the agency. The serum Quinn wanted to make is off the table for good. Let me try. <sighs> Give it a shot, Bruce. See what you can do. Stand down, people. Let him through. Well, well, Bruce Wayne. Harley. You made it out of the icebox. Good for you. Should have guessed you were working with Walla. Had me fooled. Up to a point. All I want is Riddler's blood. I get it. I leave Gotham for good. 
That agency hell beast says she don't got it, but I know she's lying through her teeth. Waller's telling the truth. The blood is gone. She tell you that? I believe her. Well, you're a freaking fool. She just wants it for herself. I'm holding all the goddamn cards. Either they give me what I want, or I play the one that goes BOOM! I ain't fooling around. I'll do it without a second thought. You're not thinking this through. Blow the bridge, you'll die. If the explosion doesn't kill you, the agency will. Bruce, come on. You can do better than that. Harley does not respond well to threats. Well, if I'm gonna die, it's gonna be on my terms, Wayne. Not some agency hacks. Stand down! Lose it! Ah, uh, Let me talk to her. I know her better than anyone. I'm so glad you're here, baby! These deadbeats want my head on a stick! You can do it, John. I believe in you. I won't let you down. I have everything worked out. Up here. Trust me. I learned from the best. Okay, just... Just what? Just don't let her push you around. Try and intimidate her. <laughs> I don't know, Bruce. That didn't seem to go so well for you. And me, well, I'm not as physically impressive as you. And besides, Harley's in just some drunk at a bar you can smack around. She deserves better than what you did to Willie. reason with her. She thinks you have her best interests at heart. I got this, Bruce. I'm just gonna be myself. Just like you told me in the cafe. Hey, don't worry about a thing. With all these people watching, how can I not live up to the occasion? Those two reprobates getting their heads together is a recipe for a disaster. John said it himself. He knows her better than anyone. As long as he keeps her talking, there's still a chance she won't blow the bridge. There's truth in that. Not enough to inspire confidence, but it's better than nothing. This is going south. We're gonna shut this down right now. If we interfere now, we could push her right back into Harley's arms. If we don't, everyone on this bridge will die. Stand by to move in, people. Alpha team, move into flank. Take your positions. Look for a clean shot. What the hell do you think you're doing? You gotta trust him, Waller. I'm telling you, he'll come through. With a marriage proposal, maybe. Not a successful resolution to the crisis at hand. You need to have faith. Stand down. You backstabbing piece of crap! Don't struggle harder. They're gonna put you in the hole. I'm gonna rip your head off, you two diamond son of a- Get her out of here. How could you, John? You broke my heart. Bruce showed me how to be good, Harley. In a way you never could. Thank you for your help, Mr. Doe. You did a great job. The virus, please. I don't think so. I don't think anyone should have this. Least of all you. Well then, we'll no longer be requiring your service. No! What are you doing? He helped us! You betrayed me! After I saved the day! <sighs> you agency people! You're just the worst! Find that faggot! And get Quinn in the truck immediately! Where's Wayne? I want him secured! 
Subdue him if you have to! Good to know you have my back. John? You corrupt pigs. You're supposed to stand for justice. But you're liars and you're murderers. And you're so goddamn rude. What the heck? What's wrong with this thing? Come on. Work! Yes! That's what I want to see! Ha, 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 ha.